Let's talk about the Patriots at the Dolphins. Patriots can be anywhere from a wild card team to the number one seed based on all of these different things happening, right? And the Dolphins have been mathematically eliminated. They cannot make the playoffs now. Uh, they had a seven-game win streak. It all came tumbling down in a 34-3 loss last week to the Tennessee Titans. Uh, but, man, you look at this. I and Obviously, historically, the Patriots have not been good when they go down to Miami. But I, I don't know that that necessarily matters here. I don't know that Miami is going to be fighting a whole lot in this spot. Like I, Maybe I'm wrong about that because of the familiarity between the coaching staffs. And some of these players just want to play, et cetera. But when you got one team that's playing for everything and one team that's literally got nothing on the table other than this is the last game, I I don't know what I take from that. Uh, the Patriots are a seven point favorite. Total is forty. Man, I'm I'm going to ride Patriots to cover the seven. Like I I think they yeah, are we, a significantly we, better team. Yeah, we're going to agree on this one. Also, I, I I think the the Pats have everything to play for. I just also think they're a the significantly better team. This yeah. is Dolphins team. We're beating that they went on a on a winning streak that was really impressive, beating just the trash of the NFL. Which this was supposed to do. don't lose to bad teams. That's fine, but 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 they they weren't anything to, to write home about at all the whole season. Most of their wins just looked difficult, looked hard, looked uncomfortable for for, for them, and and I just I just don't think there's any way on earth I'd trust them in a game where the other team has to have it. I, I tend to agree. I tend to agree.